you probably already know, a spring is an elastic object, commonly used in devices and machines. Depending on the purpose of use, they can create many types of springs of different sizes. So, have you ever seen giant springs? And what is its effect? Let's find out with the video below. Marvel at the giant spring production process. The most common metal used to manufacture coil springs is steel. The choice of steel metal will depend on the shape and application for which the coil spring will be used. So, not all springs will be made of thin steel wire. For the production process of giant springs in particular, they will need to use alloy steel raw materials. First, we learn how large springs are produced by the hot winding process. This is a process used in spring manufacturing by heating steel, tempering it to the required properties and winding the spring accordingly. So they will put the alloy steel bars into the furnace with the high temperature to create heated steel bars. After that, the steel bar will be taken out of the kiln by a pricker and stopped at a suitable position. The top of the steel bar will now be fixed and rolled to the shaft to form a spring slowly. The winding machine automatically rotates the coils of the steel into the desired spring shape, with the number of turns and the distance between the terms being adjusted as required. This process is done slowly and carefully. If necessary, you can also adjust the spring by varying the number of turns or coil pressure of the machine system. After they remove the shaft slowly from the heated spring coil, the mechanic will check its temperature with a the thermometer. Then, they will bring the spring coil to the cooling position and control the machine and produce a cold spring. The machine heat treatment process will help cool quickly and make the spring stiffer while retaining the best shape. Finally, the spring surface treatment and inspection process, which includes abrasion, size cutting to improve surface quality. Be sure to move the spring through the grinder evenly and control the grinding force to avoid deformation of the spring. They then will be brought to the area to check quality and up and down compression of the springs.
in their extensive and readily available inventory, you're sure to find the right spring for your needs. Especially if those who love color surely cannot ignore this product. Color painting for springs not only creates the best color, but it also helps protect the surface and prevent corrosion of the springs. When added the characteristic red color, it looks really attractive, right? Do you know? In addition to the hot roll away, compression springs can also be manufactured through a cold rolling process. Cold coil springs are made fully from heat treated steel metal. Then they are fixed at one end to begin to be bent on the mandrel. A guide mechanism is used in the machine to align the steel to the required height and at the same time, ensure the steel gap when bending to form a spring. Regardless of the spring size, the way springs work is really simple. They will compress when subjected to a load and expand when not subjected to the load. Because of this useful effect, they are often used quite commonly. Particularly with large springs, they will often be applied in industrial equipment, large moving machines, especially when they are important materials in the suspension system of cars, installed together with wheels to reduce shock. What do you think of these wonderful and useful springs? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to click like, share, subscribe to support us to have more motivation to make good videos. For now, hello and see you in the next videos.